there, it's Jane with Pulpit Nation, and today I'm going to take you through the reverse grab. It looks like this. Here is the breakdown. Now to do this move, you need to make sure that your hands are dry and you have a really good grip. You also need to make sure you got a strong upper body, especially in the shoulders. So this is a move you need to do later on in your kind of your pole journey. Make sure that you're doing other spins first and make sure you got a strong upper body. The reason why I say that is it is taxing on the shoulder. So strong upper body, nice dry hands. Inside hand nice and high, shoulders down and back. This move is gonna take you forwards first. You're gonna go out and around and then it's gonna take you backwards. So we're going to break down the upper body first and then we're going to look at the legs. Inside hand nice and high, shoulders down and back. Outside hand's going to come to the pole at the chest height. Then as you come around, we're going to go out around, outside hand's going to go behind the pole and we're going to bring our body out and through. So when I was learning this move, um, when I was at home with my little ones, I had spent a lot of time going walking through it. So hand comes around, walk, 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 hand comes behind, and hold. Hand across, walk around, hand behind, and hold. Now for the takeoff, I like to take off on the inside foot, outside hand's gonna come to the pull, and then I'm gonna bring my hips out and around. So it's gonna look like this, stepping on the inside foot, outside hands coming to the pole, push off, sweep out, and around. Now for the, for the feet, I'm gonna step on my inside foot, outside hands gonna to come to the pole, I'm going to pivot, I'm gonna push off, hips are gonna go out, around, and I'm gonna take it into a sun wheel positioning with my legs. The trick for this move is to get the hips out and around. So I, I like in my classes, I'll teach the ladies to think of a cliff in front of their pole. And they wanna shoot, shoot their bodies out in front, off the cliff, and out and around. That kind of visualize, visualization actually really helps. So think of a cliff in front, inside hand nice and high, step on the inside foot, shoot the hips out around, push off, and sweep them through into a sun wheel position. In the beginning, you're gonna have your arm hand up nice and high, but as you get more comfortable, then you can slide the hand down. But you wanna have a nice, strong grasp of this move first before you slide the hand down. Sliding the hand down will get you more extension, more bo your body pulled away. But you need to have a really good understanding of this move before the arm slides down. I'm gonna show you what I mean. So if my hand is nice and a little bit lower, as I come around, my body will get more away from the pole. 